evolution has this thing called carcinization. Uh, it keeps evolving things into crabs. It's convergent evolution because that's an efficient body design with the, the flat hard shell and asymmetrical claws. Likewise, society keeps evolving things into bureaucracies. Uh, let's start with the basics. Uh, there's a lot of reasons why social functions need to be performed by non-market organizations, or rather they're better performed by non-market organizations. In many ways, these are basic economic principles. Sometimes there's externalities, costs or benefits incurred on other people that a market-oriented firm would just ignore. The service might be indivisible or a collective good like national defense or pollution mitigation. Everyone benefits from those but would rather not pay into them themselves if given the choice, like with a market-oriented organization. Since market-oriented firms rely on voluntary exchange, uh, some things like, like income redistribution or law and order where there's unwilling participants, uh, they wouldn't be serviced by the free market. Likewise, relying on market-oriented firms to self-regulate or disband monopolies or, or perfectly inform consumers, that's usually a bad idea. So all of these conventional market failures need some sort of non-market organization to sort them out. Now, Downs acknowledges that there's arguments for leaving functions like the post office to the private sector, but minutia aside, if these market failures exist, by definition, it's better to have a non-market organization provide those services. Downs proposes that bureaucracies are the best sort of non-market organization to do so. Why me? Because they often require a large size for both economies of scale and to reach their clients. And those services need to be carried out by trained full-time specialists, which require formal divisions of labor to perform efficiently and hierarchies to coordinate that effort. Often, often people, including academics, argue that bureaucracies are not as efficient as free market firms in providing services. Uh, the consensus is that market-oriented firms are more efficient in their operations, but only because they can pick and choose what, where, when, and to whom they provide those services. Bureaucracies aren't perfectly optimal, neither are crabs, but if those market failures exist, the total system is closer to optimal with bureaucracies than market-oriented firms. <laughs>